There's only a few days left of the MOC, but I managed to zero cycle both sides. So let's just go over the gameplay and uh, yeah. So for this first side, we did use Jingliu, Branya, Pela, and Fushuan. Now the support is completely not needed, but I don't have Silver Wolf, so I don't even have, I can't make sil six Harmony slash uh, Nihility characters, right, for both sides. So anyways, we immediately get go into the state, right, send off one enhanced skill. Now Branya is going to uh, boost her up to the front. Now we get the ult with all of Branya's damage buffs. That's important. Now, one important part of this first side is if Jingliu kills here. Now, if it doesn't kill, it's the optimal scenario. If it does kill, it still can zero cycle the next side. It just takes like maximum am amount of actions for my relic investment level, right? But because we're able to kill with that extra shot, now we're one step closer to entering uh, the transmigration state, right? Now here, we do you don't want to use Pale's ult and then gain more energy because then the resolution light cone that I have on her, that's a one turn. And as you saw, because that uh, decaying shadow hadn't had a turn, it, it would have lost the buff or the 12% defense shred rather. So I, when you use the ult, it, uh, it's gonna get that defense buff immediately for Jimmy's turn. Um, now, pretty much, Honestly, this first side's really simple. There's there's not even that much to talk about. It's just basic defense shred. Jingliu, destroy Branya, boost to do even more destructive damage. Um, I don't even remember if this kills in... Yeah, wow. Okay, yeah. I managed to kill that without even needing a, her second turn and then Branya's second so she had two more actions left in that cycle now this is the side that i had a lot of trouble with and also the side that was a lot more interesting to to i guess play with so immediately off the bat tinyun's stance dance dance is going to boost our action forward now this is this part was interesting originally i was i was using asta's speed buff to get my don hung to have the two actions but after a little bit, I realized that I think I actually need the speed buff in the second uh, second wave, right? With the true sting. So I boosted up his speed just enough to 113, I believe. So when I use the dance, 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 along with the speed buff that uh, Yukong gives you. Actually, I guess in that case, it's probably oh, uh, maybe wasted because of E2. Dunhang's E2. Well, in that case scratch of that um but the point is, is as you can see he has just enough speed to get his last action now this is a very kind of rough point i was like does this kill with one or do i need two now, i i settled with two but i believe it would have killed with one just barely but it was it was close i think one would have done it but i did i did two to be safe i did two to be safe um Anyways, any day now, I'm sure I'll decide to kill this any day. Let's see, let's see. In the meantime, we pretty much basic attack with everything other than applying Benediction with uh, Tang Yun. I don't think we ever skill with Asta and Yukong skill once, I believe. So it's all the skill points go to Don Hung. And getting hit doesn't even matter because it, after all the basic attacks, it's going to gain enough energy. So, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, I want to make sure we don't use the speed buff until Don Hong's turn, his his second turn, because we don't want his uh, him to lose the extra speed buff. Now, Asta and Ting Yun are both on hacker space. They won't stack, but they it, it will make sure that it is up that extra twelve percent to make sure that he does get that uh, that second action in the cycle. But of course, with Asta, it's like plus fifty speed plus hacker space. So 10 speed or 12 speed. Oh, that's, uh, that's a lot of speed. A lot of speed. Anyways. Another part that was pretty scary. It's like, okay, I boosted the, uh, his damage with Ting Yun's ult. Now, is two skill points going to be enough to kill? Well, it has to be enough to kill, to be honest. I don't think it, uh, yeah. 
and it was super close. 6 4 0. Damn. Anyways, now we get the speed buff. Now all of our units will start building up their action value quicker, quicker. We're bringing down their action value quicker, quicker. Blah, 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 blah. Now Tingyun, just please don't get killed. She's the weakest on the team in terms of uh, bulkiness. So it was, uh, I was kind of scared that she was going to get hit twice. Okay. But that, that, that was the only skill of Yukong the entire, the entire one. The entire round, the entire match. But, again, the last action of the cycle. 71% crit rate, getting that ru that rutilant buff, right? He's not even 162, I think he's, he's actually 142. That's 20% uh, from Kiel. He is a terrible ratio. I mean, he's a good ratio, 1 to 2, but it's just a low number. 140 damage is, is shit. But it's okay. He'll get there. He'll get there. Jing Liu is, uh... Jing Liu is pretty high. Jing Liu is... Jing Liu is quite up there, actually. Two something. Two forty-five. And... True Swarm is dead. So now for the builds of the characters, let's see what we've got here. So for Jing Liu, she is running speed boots and she's at 136. Her crit rate is a little bit low, but that's because she's in, on the team with Fushuan, right? So she gets that extra 10%. She'll be at 37, right? Let's just say 40-ish. Uh, and then um, if it's maxed, mine's not maxed, right? And then uh, with her own... Uh, 50% buff, then she's at, she's at 90, you know, and then, uh, 247, uh, yeah, nice, 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 so she has her light cone, uh, maxed out traces, maxed out traces, uh, she's running the quantum set, right, um, as I said, speed boots, I really wish I could get a good, uh, good ice, good ice damage, but I will honestly settle with, uh, one extra roll into it, that was, uh, enough for me. So, Jing Liu has zero Eidolons, and let's get into Branya with her also zero Eidolons. Unfortunate, so sad. So, she has 134 speed with 170 crit damage. I wish that could go up higher, but the speed is speed is rough. It's really hard to get just speed and crit damage stats. No, but uh, Branya's brand new. Branya's brand new. Anyway, so, so she's got her light cone on her. She's got... Uh, I'm working on her traces. I'm working on her traces. This is going to be maxed immediately. Immediately, Branya will be maxed. Now, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know about this wind damage stuff. This wind damage stuff, I'm not going to be I'm not going to be doing that. But uh, for the... Uh, those will be 10-10. Anyways, back on track. For the relics, she's... Uh, yeah, she's just pretty much speed and crit damage. Speed and crit damage. I think that's, uh, that's pretty much what I got going. Uh, you know, just to hit 134. Four. Anyways, okay, so let's go to Pela. E5 Pela. She is 143 speed. She is not tanky at all right now uh, with 32 and 90, 960 defense. That's because of Fushuan. Right. Uh, if she wasn't on a team with Fushuan, I might uh, put her relics to something that are a little bit more um, full of, you know, tank. HP defense right now. I'm kind of just focusing on a uh, like this piece is is garbage, right? But it's um It's the speed so I just I just threw it on her for the five speed, you know, cuz uh Yeah, speed 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 Okay Pella 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 resolution resolution so important. There's the um the silver wolf the tutorial light cone It's cool and everything but no, I, I don't know. This resolution shines. I, I used it with Welt immediately. Like, I, I was my first five-star character, Welt, and I used uh, Welt with this. And uh, resolution, I think, is definitely the answer. Fushuan, Japard's Light Cone. Okay, Fushuan's boring. Let's just get this over with. 135 speed. You don't even need to level her up. She's so broke. You just throw some stuff on her. It doesn't even matter. Okay, cool. Imbibitor. He also has the quantum set. Now that is very good for this second second stage, right? Because it's week two, imaginary and quantum. 
Um, so that extra defense shred just really helps, especially with all the buffs that he gets. It's nice to add a little bit of defense defense shred too. So he is using the free to play light cone, Hertz's shop light cone rather. Uh, a 113 speed, that speed was, usually I like building him as slow as possible um, with, what is it, 102? Yeah, 102 speed, minimum as low as possible, the better, but I need the extra speed to get the extra turn without Asta, so that worked out in my favor. I just recently was able to get him to 70 crit rate. Um, now his crit damage is 140. Hopefully I can get that higher. But that's mainly just because I don't have some crit damage stats on a couple of these uh, a couple of these relics. Um, if you do have his signature light cone, that 18% crit rate is going to help so much just to be able to invest in a little bit more crit damage in some of the stats uh, and some of the pieces that um, that you might actually have those. Like for example, I have some with uh, some spiky crit damage, but I can't sacrifice on the crit rate. You know, it's just sad. Now, oh my god, the bread, bread and butter. Bread and butter. The thing about, um... The E2. It's so broken. Oh my god. It's the... This is this is what I wailed on in this game. Um, I did get Jingliu's light cone, right? But uh, I wasn't going to get his light cone. Because maybe this is actually what opened the door to... Wrong decisions bad decisions hmm. what is the worth of money really well regardless it's worth imperium on cloud nine it's worth a uh, hundred percent action advance after every ultimate that's what it's worth oh my god anyways let's get into the supports for that uh don hung team asta e6 the messenger piece boom 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 hp and defense i believe or hp and hp okay on keel and also running the extra skill point is the only reason that run was possible uh, i finished with zero skill points and if i had done one the, uh, technically that one that i had doubled double skill pointed could have killed in one skill point but it's rough to get to that scenario so this extra skill point definitely 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 helped um Okay, yeah. Anyways, one four one speed. Okay, Yu Kong uh, one three nine speed just to go before uh, Don Hung, just on some random pieces. Doesn't really make too much of a difference. Uh, she does have some bulk. Sorry, she doesn't have bulk actually. I usually have her on Bronya's light cone, so she's usually super super bulky. Uh, with like over 4k HP and like 1400 ish defense, but uh, with planetary, it's uh, it's super low, and that's the reason. Okay, level 60 planetary. Um, oh, what the fuck did I just do? Okay. Anyways, um, yeah, but anyways, okay, doesn't matter. Traces, Eidolons, E6, Yukong. Oh my God, I love Yukong. Yukong, beautiful. I actually pulled on the banner for E6 Yukong, not for E2 Don Hong, but I got so unlucky with Yukong that I just ended up getting lucky with Don Hong. Interesting, interesting. Ting Yun, so broken, so broken. 146 speed. I built her with a lot of defense um, and HP too, obviously, because Dance 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 has uh, shit stats. Uh, not getting as much value out of the attack for Benediction, but. Honestly, you just buff her with Asta, and uh, she gets raised to like 2400 attack or something like that, and then you just uh, use her benediction then. So you just open up with Asta's technique, and it's, it works out great. Works out great. Uh, dance, dance, dance. S3, hopefully that gets higher, but we'll find out. Uh, this is going to get leveled up too. I have to max out a couple of my harmonies, those last two levels. Uh, but uh, hacker space. Now, this extra, this extra speed boost is actually what helps get your character if you want to have the to build them a little less speed than 134 to get them actually past 134 so for example when you pair this on top of yukong and everything it's like you're, you're gonna be able to get that extra action cycle yeah but anyways uh thanks for watching any suggestions drop them below in the comments i appreciate it adios goodbye farewell